My first term's been really good. I'm new to the school. It's, it's been really easy to settle in and everyone's really friendly here. Like you don't feel any different because you're new. It's my first term completely. Everybody here is new to me and it's been a really smooth transition. Everybody's super friendly, teachers are great. At first it felt like, like a big change because we hadn't really mixed the boys and girls but then you realise there's nothing to worry about and um, it feels very natural. Making new friends has been just really easy. Everyone was so welcoming, being like the only person that came from my from my old school. It's been actually really good. I became friends with so many good people, such as Sophia and Stephanie. You have a lot of time to move about with your subjects. If you haven't felt like you've chosen the right one, then you can you can change your options. Which I've gone for three completely new subjects and which is politics, economics and psychology. It's learning a new subject is always amazing, especially the fact that we don't learn about financial sort of studies and how the economies work lower down the school. There's lots of co-curricular opportunities. I enjoy my sport, so I swim, part of the swim academy. We train uh, seven times a week, then I'm in the gym twice a week as well. I do um, more United Nations, Debating Society, Economic Society. A music Technology Society. School shows, they're amazing. Cricket training. And dance lessons. The feminist Society is a favourite of mine. It's uh, Newhall Choir and Orchestra. But I do hockey. The opportunities that I've been given, especially for golf, absolutely amazing. So I felt like I've excelled so much. So I've been playing rugby since year seven. And this year I've been playing the first team. Maths help support class after school. Physics Olympiad training. This so many you can pick from. My my life before boarding sounds really boring now. <laughs> the social with Dennis, football, it be basketball in the evenings or other super events like the formal dinners. We have sushi making, we've had like karaoke, games night, volleyball. Personally I've enjoyed some of the sports facilities that's open to the borders in the evening. For example, the fitness suite. Mm, I used to be in my country. We don't have re have a really good English environment, so I cannot improve improve my English. So I think it's a really good chance for me to make to make many friends with uh, local people and become uh, just become a native speaker. Many people worry about like not being able to keep up with like work and stuff, but we actually help each other with work. It is a massive jump up from GCSE to A level. But um, yeah, you get settled in, the teachers, they just help so much. And it's really good to be in, an, be in an environment where the teachers really care for your learning, they have your best interests at heart. Yeah, we definitely have a lot more independence in sixth form. We obviously have the sixth form centre we can use to do study. There's a kitchen in there, you can make teas, coffees. We can also go to the, go to the cafe, there's paninis, flapjacks, cookies, everything in there. I'm constantly making drinks between lessons, <laughs> especially when you have a double period, double mat, you need something in between, so just going to the sixth form centre and making a drink, getting a snack, and then going back to pure maths is like needed. Well, I've made some lifelong friends here. Oh, stop! <laughs> <laughs>